So I'm going to show you how to trim your video. This is for an Android device. So first you go into your gallery and open up the video and then just click on the scissors icon or it may come up as trim. This opens up the video trimmer. So this allows you to look at where you'd like to start your video and where you'd like to end your video. So as you can see, it shows a little thumbnail of what it looks like. And because we want it to film in landscape, we want to cut out all the portrait stuff at the start and the end. And we also don't want to cut out any of the talking. So we sort of aim roughly for where we think the video starts and ends. And then we just press play to check. And it starts a lot later than I thought. So what we're going to do is just move this to around here and make sure we have a start and end point. So this little arrow is showing us where the play button is. The white bars are our start and our end. So when we're ready, let's just check that's the start. Yep, that's the start. And we go done. And now it's asking us to save it as a new file. So we just call it something that you'll remember and go OK and now that will show up in your gallery um, as a trimmed file. So if you wanted to send this file to yourself just click on the video and then this little icon here with the three dots and that's going to come up with a list of options for how you want to send this video. So you can either email it to yourself, um, send it to yourself on Messenger. Another option might be to upload it to YouTube. And another option that might work is to save it to your Google Drive. So saving your files to Google Drive is ideal. This is because most mail programs have a restriction of 25 megabytes. So if your file is bigger than 25 megabytes, consider saving to Google Drive. So good luck trimming your video.